I, for one, am super excited for our next guest. We all know that we have the power to heal ourselves, but how? Our next guests are here to share some details. From the Reconnection LLC, welcome Dr. Eric Pearl and Jillian Fleer. How you doing? Hi, hey, Brian. great. Nice to see you. Nice to so see you, So good to be too. here. Yeah, I'm glad to have you. And again, I, for one, am really excited. This is uh, some amazing work that you do. So thanks for being here. Absolutely, our pleasure. We uh, love sharing about reconnective healing mm -hmm. around the world, really because it's so important to us. It's not just about us healing from an injury or a problem or a tumor. It's not just about returning to health. It's about our evolution beyond where we've been mm -hmm. to someplace more, to not just physical and mental and emotional and spiritual, but to life progress mm -hmm. of who we are personally, relationships, and more. And I think mm. because it's so tangible, you don't have to imagine it. Mm -hmm. Let's take 10 seconds and go ahead and we'll let's let you, watch let you feel an interaction so okay. that you have a firsthand experience that you can honestly share with your okay. viewers. Good. So, Brian, hold your hand up here, open your fingers. Hold them wide, hold them still, if you can. Now notice, when I bring my hand in here, can you see your fingers moving? Mm -hmm. <laughs> are you moving your fingers or are they moving themselves? I wouldn't say I'm moving them. Okay. So let's talk about what is moving them. So just keep an eye on that. This and is quantum mechanics. This is the most beautiful part of where we are in this moment in understanding true healing, uh -huh. which isn't about curing, or fixing a problem. It's about this overall way we return to harmony and balance. It's so about something much larger than treatment and therapy and curing, something that tends to include that, but brings us to a whole new level. Mm -hmm. So part of what um, is, and look at that. See that? You see that? Yeah. That interaction is what we call the field. And the field is comprised of energy, light, and information. So just this movement is the your heck? DNA. Right. Isn't that beautiful? Yes. So your let's, DNA let's restructuring you. itself to carry a higher, more coherent level of information. Good. And so that is what makes you much healthier, much more, I'm going to say, active in your ability to be in your emotional balance, mental balance, physical balance, mm -hmm. and this is scientifically right. supported. Mm -hmm. So while we're here, Brian, let me know, what do you feel when we do this? I feel like there's a pulling on both sides. Yes. Uh-huh. Is that right? Yes. And I feel like I'm not moving my fingers. Like I can feel like it, it starting to move, but it's, I'm not doing it. And you see them, right? Yeah, like I'm like, oh, now, my finger's gonna move, but I'm not doing it. Notice the sensation. Does it stay the same or does it change? It feels like it's changing. How? I feel like you're pulling upwards. <laughs> the further I pull away, does it get weaker? Does it actually become stronger? It feels stronger. Right. It? It's the opposite of what we know about energy because this takes us beyond energy healing, like okay. Reiki and all the techniques that we've ever heard of yeah. into something that includes all the gifts of all of the known energy healing techniques without us ever having to learn them and then brings us into something far more expansive as the scientists explain it. Reconnective healing, the frequencies bring us into new aspects of light energy and information by the way we brought you this book you did you're so you. sweet it's for you again i was super just i couldn't wait to have you two on and we're going to get you back because we're, we're out of time we're going to invite folks to the riviera Hi.